Choco butternut. Butternut? Butternut. There have been establishments like Starbucks, which have temporarily opened during the quarantine. Select branches of Dunkin' have reopened for delivery as well. We know you miss those delicious munchkins. But what if you don't want to incur too much for the delivery? Even then, Dunkin' isn't available in the whole country yet. Well, we've got you covered with this homemade recipe for choco butternut munchkins made by Eunice Akupanda. We get your obsession for choco butternut. Let's list all the ingredients we need. For the chocolate cake part, we'll need 1 cup of all-purpose flour, 1 third cup of cocoa powder, 1 teaspoon of baking powder, 1 teaspoon of baking soda, 1 cup of sugar, half teaspoon of salt, 2 eggs, 1 fourth cup of vegetable oil, half cup of milk, 1 teaspoon of vanilla extract, 1 teaspoon of black coffee, plus 1 third cup of hot water mix, 1 tablespoon of distilled white vinegar, butternut, let's go! Then, for that sweet chocolate glaze, prepare half cup of powdered sugar, 1 fourth cup of cocoa powder, 1 fourth cup of evaporated or fresh milk. For the butternut streusel coating, we'll have 1 cup of all purpose flour, 4 tablespoons of butter, 4 tablespoons of sugar, orange food coloring liquid, half teaspoon of vanilla. First off, we'll do the cake part by preheating our oven to 350 degrees. Let's prepare two bowls, mix the flour, cocoa, baking soda, baking powder, and salt in one. Then mix the vegetable oil, sugar, milk, vanilla extract, and coffee mixture on the other. We'll beat the egg while sprinkling the white vinegar into the mix. Let's combine those two bowls but be careful not to overmix them. Finally, we'll place the cake batter in a grease pan then bake it in the oven for 25 to 30 minutes. This will be our little munchkin balls. Make sure to refrigerate them so they'll maintain their form. For the glaze, simply combine its ingredients and set them aside. Moving on to the streusel. Melt the butter on a pan over medium heat. Sprinkle them some sugar, pour the vanilla, then add the flour. Keep mixing until you get that streusel. Finally, Mix in the food coloring, you can actually use any color you want but nothing really beats orange. Now, for the final phase, dip the chocolate bowls in glaze then on the streusel for the coat. Keep them on the fridge overnight to let its form set. Your delicious homemade choco butternut munchkins will greet you first thing in the morning. May I take your order sir? Choco butternut please. <laughs>